What is up guys? It's Caraman Pokemon and today we have something very exciting. We have a Champions Path opening. We have the three pin boxes and we're going to open them all in this video. So I got a little bit lucky. The mailman delivered these three pin boxes early somehow. I don't know what happened. I think they come out next Friday, the 25th of September. So for today, we're opening all three pin collection boxes with the amazing gym leader badges. And I can't wait to show you guys. Next week, on either Monday or Tuesday, I'm opening the Japanese set Astonishing Voltage, which is a preview of Vivid Voltage and the Chunky Pikachu. So make sure to hit that notification bell and see when my videos go live. Let's enjoy, hope you like it. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. Let's go. All right, let's look at the first pin. We got the turf field gym, of course, represented by Milo the grass type slash buck type trainer. Man, these look really good. Um, I got something cool. This is a, a league badge box. I will highlight a picture on screen where you can see that uh, the original gym badges were on there. But um, for today, I thought it would be cool to kind of open up as we struggle with this one. I'm so nervous, guys. I'm so nervous. So be patient with me. Be patient with me. I'm going to butcher this package. Oh, here we go. Here we go. We got it open. Let's put it to the side. Here we go. Champion's Path. Oh, man. There's nothing like as Eldegoss falls out. Here we go. The promo Eldegoss. That looks absolutely stunning. I really like Eldegoss. Let's put you in the back. And then, oh, I love that Pokemon did this. Look at this. Your first gym badge from the Turfield gym after defeating Milo. And for this series, guys, I'm going to open up every pink collection. And I'm going to add it to my league badge. And, of course, we have three packs and the promo. So, for you Code Cards hunters out there, here is the promo. I think that will give you probably Eldegoss. Um, Woo! First three packs of Champions Path. And before I get into these packs, I have an amazing giveaway going on where you can win four ETBs. The links are in the description. I'm doing it with three other YouTubers, Seismic Shock TV, Uncertified Fire, and Agile Vox. And uh, yeah, check those guys out, check their video out because you wanna win four ETBs. So uh, that was the mandatory plug for the giveaway. Now let's get into some packs. Who should I start with first? Gardevoir is definitely my favorite. Then Alchemy. So let's start with the Galarian Obstagoon. Oh, and we see Vulpix. Shout out to Agile Fox on the front. And as you guys know, here's the code card. First code card, Champions Path. Of course, you can pull the shiny Charizard and the full art, or not the full art, the rainbow rare G-Max Charizard. As we have fire from the beginning, can we get fire? Hit that like button, guys. Turfield Stadium, that is classic. We are opening up the Turfield Stadium box. Hop, also a full art. And there is the magnificent Vulpix. Very cool. I'm gonna take it easy. I'm gonna take it easy. Rock Rough, Purloin. We got Nicket, some amazing artwork in this. Sizzlipede. Then we have the Machop Reverse. Seismic Shock TV, can we get a Hollow Machamp? We get a hollow Lycan Rock. Here we go. Wow, I do like the hollows on this set. And yeah, I'm very curious. Let's put that in the sleeve. I'm very curious about the pull rates. The pin collections for, for example, Hidden Fates were really good. The Mewtwo and uh, Mew pin collections. Those were, uh, they had some really good pull rates. So I'm curious to see what we can get from these pin collections. And yeah, they're, they're very early, guys. I got lucky. Um, I'll explain my why I got so lucky in a bit. But uh, yeah, these come out, I think, September 15th. I saw some news about September 18th, which is uh, this Friday. But I think it's September, not September 15th, September 25th. Vulpix, Inke, we got Pokeball. We got Kabu, which is also a secret rare in this set. And... 
We got the Matchamp Hollow. Let's go. Shout out to Seismic Shock TV with the Matchamp. Very cool. I, I really like Matchamp as a Pokemon. I can't wait to see what they will do for the, the G Max or V Max uh, Matchamp. So, last pack from the first thing collection. Can we pull something fire? There is guaranteed hollows in this set. So, although pulling hollow is nice, it. Um, it is not really a hit in this set because you, yeah, you get a hollow in every, every pin uh, or every pack. Water Energy, Team Yell Grunt, Rotom Foam. There is Milo from this pin. We got the Full Heal, Scraggy, Ekans, Kakuna. We got Nickit. There's Hatram Reverse, and for their last rare from this pin, we got a Santa Scorch Hollow. So I think Tojo really liked this. So shout out to Tojo. This is an amazing hollow as well. Santa Scorch, another cool Pokemon. Of course, we got the VMAX of that in Darkness Ablaze. So who should we start with? Nessa or Kabu? Um, let's go with Nessa. Let's look at that for a bit. The water type gym leader. Very awesome. Um, and if you see the, the anime shorts on YouTube from Pokemon with Nessa and the Milotic, oh, that was one of my favorites. Very cool. So let's get in there. Uh, I'm going to butcher it again, guys. So I'm sorry about that. Oh, this is okay. This is okay. This is actually manageable. This is the way to do it. Let's put that on the ground. Let's look at that. The Dretnaw falls out. Let's look at that Dretnaw. Dang, that is one heck of a hollow card. He uses Spice Bite to chew up that branch. Awesome, awesome looking hollow. I, I love these promos with the with the full hollow on the background. That just looks amazing. Oh, I didn't sleep up Elder Goss. I'm sorry, Elder Goss. Let, let's sleeve you up just to make sure. Yeah, guys, if you're enjoying this content, early Champions Path, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. Here is the Water Gym Leader badge. How cool is that? Adding it to my gym leader case. There we go. We got, we defeated the grass type gym. We defeated Milo and now we defeated Nessa or we're gonna defeat Nessa. Let's see, here is the code for the Dreadnought, I think. Very awesome. Let's put some stuff on the sides. And we got three more packs. It's two times the Alchemy and one time the Obstacoon. So let's start with the Obstacoon. Oh man, I hope, I hope it's full of full art. I'm very curious to see how rare it is gonna be to be able to pull that VMAX Rainbow Charizard or Shiny Charizard. I have a lot of Champions Path on the way, so I'm definitely gonna try to pull it, but I think it's gonna be very difficult. Malamar, I think this is a reprint from an earlier set, or I might be confusing with the Japanese sets. Full Heal, Purloin, Kakuna. We got Trubbish looking very happy, I like that. Athena also looking very happy. We got Santa Scorch Reverse. That is very cool, a reverse rare. And then for the rare, we got another Machamp. So two hollow Machamps already. All right, let's put that to the side and start with Alchemy Packs. I am hoping we can pull something, but at the same time, if the pull rates are difficult, you now of course I wanna pull something, but I don't mind difficult pull rates. That just means that the value of the, the difficult cards in the set are gonna go up and I kinda like myself a chase card. So I have a good excuse to open more packs. Victini, let's look at that a little bit. Victini, wow, very cool. So Hyper Potion, Rotom Phone, Regular Potion, Rock Ruff, Weedle, the Claymation version, Swablu, we got Kakuna, and another Santa Scorch Reverse. So that's double Santa Scorch Reverse. Can we pull something? We got a hollow professor's research. So I think this is a reprint from Sword and Shield base, which I'm okay with, but we could have done something different Pokemon. We could have done something different instead of having a reprint hollow. But okay, okay, you, you gave us the Charizard. So I think I think we, we can't complain. You gave us what we really want, the Charizard. So um, don't mind me, let me pull a Charizard right now. Let's pull it. We've had five hollows already, no real hits. So let's go. Electric Energy, we got Lipart, Team Yell Grunt, Machoke, Swablu, 
Scraggy. We got Kafana. Galarian Zigzagoon. Another Kakuna. I feel like Kakuna has been in every pack. A Macho Reverse. That is one awesome. He's looking like he's fighting in the streets. That is one heck of a Macho. I think Seismic will like that. And another Lycan Rock. Wow, guys. Six packs and six hollows. That means we haven't got a hit yet. Ooh, these pink collections might be very difficult. Or I, I just got it early <laughs> because uh, because the pools weren't good. They were like, oh, we can send this early. So yeah, why did I get this early? Um, no, I don't have any connections. It is all luck. Uh, what I did and what I try to do sometimes is uh, a couple of weeks or days before release. Wow, this is, I'm struggling with this one. Um, a couple of weeks before release, a lot of the distributors or shops already have stuff in storage. So I always try to place um, a cheeky order a little bit just before release, hoping that uh, somebody makes a mistake and, and accidentally sends some stuff out that they shouldn't have been sending out. Dang, this Santa Scorch looks amazing. Really like that, okay. So yeah, it, there's nothing really to it. It is just pure luck. I don't have any connections. I don't, so don't expect me to have early access every time. But um, yeah, for this one, I got lucky. And here is the third gym badge. This is probably my favorite because it's like the Santa Scorch uh, logo or figure. Let's put that there. So we got three badges down, five more to go as we collect more of the pin collections. So uh, this is our first Dreadnought pack, I think. And here is, oh, here's double codes. Wait, double codes, double codes. Does that mean, do we get double Charizard as well? Double codes, guys. That is special. So let's save the Dreadnought for last. The last three packs. Guys, I hope you enjoyed. Despite us not pulling anything yet, we still have three packs left. I am really enjoying it. I can't wait for Championship, Champions Path to come out. And, um, also, I have an early, early, early release, not early release, but um, uh, Astonishing Volt Tackle. I, I think I messed it up in the intro, but it is Astonishing Volt Tackle is coming out uh, this Friday, the Japanese set, and I'm opening it either Monday, next Monday or uh, Tuesday. So stay on watch for that because that is gonna be a heck of a set. Vault Picks, always love Vault Picks. Potion, Full Heal, Roly Coley, love to say that, Roly Coley. We got Zygarde Reverse. So we're doing great on the Reverse Rares, but can we pull something special? Oh, there we go. Lucario V. Definitely one of the cooler V cards to get. Love Lucario. Happy to see it getting a V card. Just look at that. On the, in the city, doing his Arrowsphere. So you are getting a sleeve, my friend. Lucario V, very cool. Let's put that to the side. So two packs left. Hopefully, hopefully we can get something super special. If not, I am still very happy being able to open these packs up before release and uh, sharing it with you guys. Here we go, here we go. I feel the last card is a little bit bent. Hop, Hatron, and sometimes that means it's like a little stronger card. Trubbish, can we get something here? Potion, Galarian Lanoon, Nicket, Machop, Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, there's reverse energies again in the set. And look at that one. I think we got the best one, the fire one. Can we pull some fire after this? A half rim hollow. So let's put that fire energy down and appreciate the hatherine. I said hatherine, but it's hatherine, of course, the evolution of hatherine. Very cool as well. So getting a sleeve and also we're gonna sleeve up that fire energy because wow, look at that. That is very glossy. Very excited about that. So last pack, can we get last pack magic? Can we pull the sword? That would be one heck of a way to end the video. Oof, last pack magic, can we do it? Charizard, are you in here? If you are, please say hello. Okay, let's go, four from the back. Let's go guys, water energy, hit that like button if you haven't, we got a bead, Pierce. Suspicious food in this comes into a gold card. I think it's the only gold card from the set. Carvana, Potion, Vulpix, Machop, Roly Coley, Bead, and the last card. Can we pull something? Oh! <laughs> this guy's Kabu 
out of the Kabu Pink Collection. Can you get it any better than that? We get a rainbow rare Kabu. Wow, and look at that. I am super happy about this. No, it's no Charizard, but it is a rainbow pool out of nine packs. Wow, 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 wow. Hit the like button, subscribe if you're new, because that is one heck of a pool to end off with. Whoa, 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 guys. Look at I'm super happy. So I think let's 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 review what we got for minutes and, and let's appreciate the gym badges and, and the and the sets. Honestly, I think this is an amazing idea. I, I Agile Fox talked to me about an idea that he's gonna do with these gym badges and check him out, guys. He has a fun series planned when these uh, pink collections officially release. So here we have, we got the fire energy, we got the Hatherine, Lucario V, very awesome, Lycanroc, we got Professor's Research, eh, a little bit of reprint, do something new Pokemon, Matchamp, shout out to Seismic, there we got the Santa Scorch, another Matchamp, Lycanroc again, and finishing off last pack magic, with Kabu, holy cow. Guys, thanks for watching. I, I hope you liked it. Hit that like button and subscribe if you're new. I would really appreciate it. This was the cameraman. I'll see you next time, but for now,